Hello, Fernando. Thank you very much for the invitation for the interview process. I am really pleased that you invited me and uh, it's such a big honor. I also decided to wear the embroidery shirt because I saw that Mikhne did that with his Romanian one and I wanted to show the classical Ukrainian one. So I will begin with your questions and the first one is so I was studying in another city uh, in the north east of Ukraine, uh, Kharkiv, and I had a sister. She was here in Zaporizhia, and we were exchanging letters, postcards. But I was preferring postcards. I liked them, and she has shown me this website, uh, post crossing, uh, to send some messages to random people, and I've registered back then. Uh, it was around seven years ago. Uh, I don't have it with me right now because uh, I was moving this year a lot, uh, you know why, but it was this one. It was uh, from Netherlands. It was a green card with um, a lot of letters, words. So actually it is funny because it was my mistake. I wrote that I want a lot of letters. That's how I was meaning that I want actually a lot of stories to be written on the back side. But the guy decided to send a lot of letters on the front side because I didn't have such a good English that time. And that's why I made it like that. Uh, I mean, wrote it in the post-crossing profile like that. So it's this one. Uh, it's from Ukraine, from one post crosser, Aleona Hrikun. Uh, there is a sign that uh, while optimists and pessimists were quarreling about uh, the glass, is it empty or not, I was drinking it. I like it because there is such a nice uh, llama. The, um, signature is very funny and I like drinking wine. This is an advertisement postcard, which is not my favorite type of postcards, but I liked it so much because it was the first card that I received that really touched my heart and it's also beautiful on the other side, so I like it a lot. Thank you, Alona, again. <laughs> Thank you. it's to choose the best card for the uh, wish list of the person. I like challenges, I like hard, difficult, complex wish lists, like I need a person to show the witch with green eyes, blah blah. So that's a challenge to find the exact card for his or her wish list. I like it. I have a postcard shop. And that's interesting. I'm trying to send cards not from my shop. I'm trying to buy cards from different shops so that I have a lot of different, different cards. I think that I have around 10k cards from the other shops. So how do I keep them in different boxes? I have... A lot. I also like these different boxes, and they are um, separated by different topics. So you can see, for example, that here are um, illustrations of people, for example, you know, and in the other one it's uh, food, etc. So that's how I keep my postcards. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks everyone for the attention. Uh, Slava Ukraini!